Hello. Today I'm gonna to try to make a quick video about this uh, HP laptop. We're gonna disassemble it, uh, replace the thermal paste, and uh, reassemble it after that. The laptop is uh, HP 250 G5. So let's start, of course, with removing the battery. We're gonna remove all the screws. As much as I remember, on this laptop, the whole palm rest with the plastic and the keyboard is coming off, so we'll try now. This is here for the optical drive and after we remove these two screws I think there is uh, two more hidden under the rubber pads. Now there's two options and I think the back cover is coming off. Just use something sharp to separate the plastics. Basically that's We're gonna close it and we're gonna try and separate it and just be careful with the plastic here. like this now we're gonna remove the screws here for the fan And for the color also. Uh, 
always check the hinges because with the time they are getting loose and this can cause the plastic to break so check them gently leave the cooler not a lot of damage as you can see if the camera can focus now we're gonna clean We're going to use a little alcohol. Like this, we're gonna clean that cooler also. Usually uh, the fans on this model are sealed here, so you can't uh, disassemble the fan to clean it much further. But if the fan is in a very bad condition, you can cut those three plastics on this side. After that you can remove the, the plastic piece here with the propellers. You can uh, lubricate it and after that you can put it back again. And on this side, or you can use a soldering iron just to melt the plastic again or you can just put two pieces of tape on both sides so you can uh, hold the metal for the plastic and you can reuse the fan no need to replace it so after we clean the cooler and the CPU we're gonna apply a little thermal paste because the one that was on the CPU was a lot that's why it got around the CPU. Uh, I'm using Arctic MX2, pretty decent thermal paste, very good quality. So let's apply a little bit on both dies. Like this. Don't put too much.
there is some weird plastic here I don't know from where probably somebody opened it before me <laughs> now let's check yeah okay everything is fine now we're gonna put back the fan we're gonna plug it first Tweezers. Now, after everything is connected, we can put back the plastic, insert this side here because the connectors here for the VGA and for the USB can go inside the plastic. And after that, just pull the rest. the boring part putting all the screws back We're going to put back the optical drive. That's basically the procedure. Just remove the screws, remove the back cover, and 
replace the thermal paste. Let's check. Yeah, everything is okay. Do we have a battery or I have to charge it? No, we don't have a battery. Let me put the charger so we can check. Yeah, we have a picture. So basically that's the whole procedure. Hope you like the video. Bye bye for now.